Hi everyone, this is Brian from Zoom, and I'm here to introduce you to the G3XN and G3N multi-effects processors for guitarists. Each pedal comes with an array of preloaded effects and patches, as well as faithful recreations of essential guitar tones. Plus, the G3XN has a built-in expression pedal, offering guitarists even more versatility. For this video, I'll be using the G3XN to demonstrate how to use the pedals. The G3XN and G3N have a mono quarter inch input and stereo quarter inch outputs. With the aux input, you could play along to backing tracks from your phone, computer, or other music playback device. Both pedals are powered by the Zoom 8016 power adapter. Our free Zoom Guitar Lab software lets you view and download new patches. Simply connect your G3XN or G3N to your computer via USB. Each pedal has two modes, memory mode and stop mode. Press the memory slash stop button to toggle between modes. When using memory mode, you can switch between different patches. A patch contains a chain of effects. Within a patch, effects can be turned on and off. In addition to using the unit's preset patches, you can also create your own custom patches. When using stop mode, you could turn individual effects on and off within the different patches. Depending on which mode you are using, the pedal's scroll buttons will have different functions. When using memory mode, the scroll buttons will switch between banks of patches that will appear on the pedal's displays. This will change which effects are available via foot switch. When using stop mode, the scroll buttons will change which individual effects are available via foot switch. To access the tuner slash tap tempo options, hold the memory slash stomp button. Use the appropriate foot switch to select the desired functionality. Use the menu button to access general settings and the control knob to navigate through options. Press the control knob to make a selection. Options include adding or deleting effects, rearranging the patch chain, or renaming or storing the patch. To add effects to your patch, Press the menu button and use the control knob to select add. If seven effects are already in use, the add option will not be available. Press the control knob to enter the add screen and choose where the effect will appear in the chain. Then use the up and down type buttons to choose the effect type. Most effects will be assigned to the foot switches, while pedal effects will be assigned to the foot pedal. To reorder your effects chain, press menu. Then use the control knob to find the chain option and select it. Use the control knob to highlight the effect you wish to move, then push the knob in to select the desired effect. To exit any option on the menu screen, simply press the menu button. This will take you back to the home screen. To remove an effect from your patch, go to menu, then select delete. To edit the name of a patch, go to menu, then select patch. Scroll and select to change letters and rename the patch. To save the patch, go to Menu, then select Save. You can either overwrite the current patch, overwrite another existing patch, or save it to an empty patch slot. To adjust effect parameters on your G3XN or G3N, use the knobs below the display for each foot switch. Each category of effects will have different adjustable parameters. Everything explained in this video is available on the G3XN as well as the G3N. For more information and product updates, please go to zoom-na.com.